Hey everyone, this is Mr. Everything, and this is quite a different video, but I thought maybe it could help someone out there uh, if you use Degree Men's Deodorant. Uh, it seems like, as with everything, things are just getting made cheaper and cheaper and asking more for them. Uh, they'll say it's inflation, but you'll notice your paycheck doesn't uh, increase much. But uh, to get more to the point, uh, De Degree seems to be about the only deodorant that works really well for me. Uh, I've used it probably for well over 10 years. There might be other kinds out there that would work, but this is what I've settled with over the years that always works. Um, this is the kind that I normally got, and I, I get a little extra now since, uh, you know, the whole toilet paper thing. I try and keep a few months worth uh, extra of everything. So I have a bunch of these still, but I recently bought a new one, and I noticed after I bought it, you can see the casing is just a little bit uh, different. It's more of a matte looking and this is but it's also uh, flimsier it's just easier to squeeze to where so you can tell it's thinner and made cheaper which i figured but you can see that it says it's the same uh 2.7 ounces so uh, i thought well maybe they just cheapened up the packaging uh this is a new one i threw the other one away but i noticed that this one i mean <laughs> look i accidentally i didn't mean to push it that hard uh, it's like really soft and uh, so you can see already was that I noticed that whenever I'd put it on like I would have to keep turning it like I would put one armpit on or on the armpit and then I would have to turn it for the other one and I was like I never had to do that before and I just kept noticing like wow I'm really going through this quickly uh, this is the older kind which I'm not going to see I can kind of do it if I push it really hard but I obviously when I apply it I don't push it that hard but you can see just a little chunk of this one came out, but this one just, if you press it, it just does a smaller portion that comes out. And uh, what I had noticed then, since this is softer, that uh, the t-shirts that I wore a few times with just that deodorant, the newer deodorant, already had like giant stains in them. And I hate uh, deodorant stains, uh, that's something I never had with this style. So the first thing I decided to do was go look on Walmart and Amazon reviews. Most are all positive, because again, this is a good product, but people are starting to get these ones, and I've seen these reviews go back as far as like last summer, so 2022. Uh, people are saying, what happened to the formula? It's softer now, it's staining and ruining my t-shirts. So a lot of them are still good, because people, I went to my Walmart the next day and bought like uh, several of these, I get the two pack of this kind. This is how you can tell the difference matte cap matte body and then this is all glossy and this is the better one and then someone had mentioned that uh, they think that they cheapened them up so they'll you'll buy the more expensive 72 hour and i i picked one of these up to try it out and i did notice uh, first off the it's like the harder plastic like this and this goes for a little bit more Again, I usually buy the two packs, so I'm not sure what uh, per cat or per uh, unit would be, but this one was like at least a dollar or so more. But you can see again, it's the harder kind. I'm really pushing down on it. And it's really hard to. So this is working as it should, like this kind. So basically, they're just selling you the same thing. Now this one's supposed to be advanced for 72 hour, but uh, quite frankly, at 48, I mean. Uh, you can't go as much as I sweat. You can't go that long without needing to take a bath anyway. So I'm not sure uh, the marketing there. But I guess if you want this same quality and consistency, you'll have to, once these uh, run out, like this batch of them, you'll have to switch to this newer one that costs a little more, which I would have just preferred them just maybe raise the price of this a little bit and keep it instead of fooling people with this, whatever this crap is. So my advice would be, uh, wherever you buy these at, I wouldn't go with Amazon because you don't know what you'll get. But uh, if you can go in the store, if they have these, I mean, don't buy like $100 worth, but you know, get enough for six months or a year. Depends on how quickly you go through it. And then if you go back and you need more and you see these, you'll have to try and find the 72 hour. And uh, let me think here, I got a shirt. This was what I wore. I think I just wore it. I didn't even wear it all day. Just had to go somewhere. And it's black. And you can see, first off, I don't even know how I got it up here. It must have just been put one arm through. And uh, this is inside out. But you can see, I didn't wear it that much. 
and it just looks terrible. So again, that's why that will ruin your shirt in no time indoors. I wear sleeveless shirts. So then it goes all on the outside and it just makes a mess and it won't come off in the wash. You have to scrape it and pick at it and then it'll finally come off. Uh, and that's just from wearing it one time. So imagine if you had a shirt and you wore this every day, uh, you would just stain it and cake it into your shirt and ruin it. So that's why I don't recommend it. If somehow it'll work for you, then okay. But just keep in mind, you'll probably have that issue with this. So get the old kind, pay attention now when you buy them or you go the 72 hour and pay a little more. So I figured I'll just put that out there. Hopefully it'll help someone. I mean, it's not surprising. I know things like this happen, but I figured I'd just let you know to be on top of it if you don't want to end up with uh, poorly performing, uh, shirt ruining deodorant, go with uh, one of these two. And maybe they'll uh, change and go back to this, or maybe they'll smarten up and put uh, the new stuff in this and fool everyone, who knows? And who knows where in the supply chain uh, if you can keep getting these, how much longer these will be. So this might be more relevant a year from now because my Walmart just started getting these in now. But uh, I'll just leave it there. Be on the lookout. So uh, thanks for watching, and you'll see me in the next one. Have a good one.